you should respect that. So when I turn and walk, he healed already. If oh, I so stop, good. he should stop and three, two, walk. Oh wow, that's awesome. How that's developed is oh. repetitious conditioning. By the way, I didn't come out and save you because I wanted to show you. I'm glad that you that did. I was like, I he did not do he, that with me. I saw exactly what he did when he came out the door, but this is how it works. I'm going to get him a little bit closer. So when he does go to pull, tank, come. Come on, Tanky. Come on, come on, come on. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. I back up, say come, mm -hmm. rinse and repeat. Okay. I don't wait for him to listen because mm -hmm. I'm in control. If I wait for him, then he's in control. So if I see he starts to pull out, I back up and tank, come. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Good and boy. And throw his hips into you. So when I walk with him, it's in impressive. general, it's called controlled walking. Mm -hmm. That means I'm in control. It's not a command. Mm -hmm. Now, he does actually heal really well, which kind of comes normal to his leaning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, for example, if I walk him back and forth from gate to gate, we simply go, and it's not left hand side, right hand side right now. And it's literally just, you're a dog, be a dog. Come, the boy. If he gets close to the end of the leash, I just call him, and we just keep going. Mm -hmm. The idea is, oh, what's your poor baby? <laughs> just to get him to realize that He's moving with me, wow. and it's okay to be a dog. You can sniff, you can mm -hmm. pee, but you have to do it within six feet. When you establish that, you'll always know. He'll walk five and a half feet out, slow down. Walk five and a half feet out, slow down. The key is, when you walk him, this starts the moment you walk out the door. Mm -hmm. That's where it'll help when you bring him out. It starts at that gate right there. It sure did. I open it up, and I immediately back up and tank, come. Good boy. And then when you do that enough, when you go to walk with him, he pretty much <laughs> will just stop next to you. Good boy. Yeah, when I came out, it was I told him he was dragging me all the way over to see the gentleman sitting in that car. Mm -hmm. He actually wanted to get in my car, and he's only been in it once. He remembered. Yeah, he's just a happy clan. He, yeah, look but at him. Once you start doing that, then you can, ca can have him heal, which is basically mm -hmm. a more formal form of walking. Healing is essentially what he's doing right now, mm -hmm. is to walk at your heel. So if I say, Tanky, heel, come on, come on, I know you want to lay down. So healing <laughs> is not fun for him. That means he has to walk with me. Come on, come on, good heel. And walking with me can't be any fun, especially if he wants to sniff everything. Right. But, mm -hmm. come on. That means he has to stay next to me. How I do that is just encourage him by saying, come on, 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 come on. But I just use the leash to guide him, and then when mm -hmm. I stop, tank, that's it. Good boy. Good boy.